Hello. So we're ready. We are ready to do the practice work of breath work for the root chakra. So I'm so glad you're here. The root chakra is imperative to get that balanced. That's the one that says I am secure and grounded. My basic needs are met and I am fearless. We got to keep that balance because that's the foundation for everything else that we do. So the breath work that we're going to be using, the technique, is called Mulad Hara Chakra Pranayama. It's chakra balancing. That's a mouthful. Let me spell that first word for you. M-U-L-A-D-H-A-R-A. Chakra Pranayama. P-R-A-N-A-Y-A-M-A. Muladhara Chakra Pranayama. It's for balancing your chakras. So that's the official name of this technique, but I call it the toddler breathing. The reason I call it the toddler breathing is because when babies come and toddlers are out and about walking, they know how to do this without any teaching. This is the natural way the body was created to breathe properly get good, rich oxygen fully into the lungs and distribute that through the whole entire system. It balances that energy, though. This one balances that root shock energy. So it's a three-tier breathing technique. It's the lower abdomen. It's the abdomen where the stomach is. And it's the upper lung. So basically what's going to happen is you're going to take a deep breath and you're going to watch and feel your lower belly kind of push out like it's being filled up with like a balloon. And then right above it, it's going to fill out as well, push out a little bit. And then you're going to feel the air come up high in the lungs as you fill it up. And then when you exhale, it's just the opposite. You allow the lungs to begin to release the air. You allow the belly, the upper belly, the stomach area to come back in to the body. And then the last, you allow the lower abdomen to come back into the belly. This is a three-tier breath. So you always start with good positioning, okay? Make sure your sit bones are connected to a CD service. So regardless if you're sitting on the floor, crisscross applesauce, or you're sitting in a chair, make sure your sit bones are sitting firmly on the surface. So some of us are full-figured women, so you might need to go in there and move some of that flesh out, pull some of those cheeks out, get those bones anchored and grounded. And from there, begin to Sit erect with your spine, putting one vertebrae on top of the other till you get to the base of the skull. Once you get to the base of the skull, kind of move your head around a little bit. Find that place where your chin is horizontal to the ground. Then sit comfortably. What shall you do with your hands? Well, if you're with the mindset or intention to receive, put your palms up. This is a simple one. We're not using any mudras right now. Just put your palms up if you want to receive. If you are interested in giving to yourself, turn your palms down and just place them on either the top of your legs or on your knees. Okay. So now that we've got our physical set and ready, Let's practice some just regular, everyday breathing that you might have. That's how you breathe. So just kind of relax your body. And just observe how you actually breathe. Just take a moment. Watch your breath come in. Watch your breath go out. Don't change anything. Just watch it.
All right. I'd like you to put your right hand on your lower abdomen, right above the pubic bone. Feel that lower tummy right in your hand. I'd like you to take your left hand and put it high above your heart. Continue breathing. And remember, this is a three-tier breathing technique. We're going to take a couple deep cleansing breaths. So exhale and take a deep cleansing breath through the nose and let it out gently through your nose. Again, deep breath in. And let it go. Now I just want you to rest there with your hands in position, breathing naturally. One last cleansing breath in. And let it go. Now I would like you to begin with a deep breath in your lower belly and let it push out into your hand. Continue deep breathing. Watch your tummy come out. All the way up through your lungs, your upper chest. Fill that chest up. And release through your nose. Let the chest fall back down. Let the tummy area come back in and bring that lower ab back in. Rest, breathe, inhale. Lower abdomen goes out into your hand. Tummy goes out. Chest fills up, rich oxygen. Exhale through your nose, chest gently releases. Stomach area comes in, exhale. Lower abs come back in. Inhale, lower abs go out, abdomen goes out, chest lifts, take it in. Exhale, lower, release the lungs, tummy comes in, lower abs come in. Inhale. Lower abs go out, tummy goes out, lungs fill, rich, rich oxygen. Gently release the lungs, let them go down. Stomach area goes in, lower abs go in. Now continue at your own pace. Be mindful of your inhale. Gently relax, let it loose and exhale. Continue on.
very gently now and with so much kindness and patience begin to take a deep breath for clearing and release it. Again, deep breath in and release. Allow your eyes to begin to flutter, gently coming back to yourself, becoming aware of where you are in the room, and allow your eyes to flutter open. It has been a true pleasure to breathe with you today. And with that, I say namaste. This particular breathing technique can be used to center, to balance the root chakra, and is easily incorporated in your meditation or your quiet time. You can do it for five minutes. You can do it for 20 minutes. It's yours. It's your breath. It's your opportunity for self-care and for centering on that area, that foundational area that's so crucial. May you be blessed this day and every day. Ashe. <laughs>